Well, from Clear Lake High School, this is the Hunt program working for NASA. This is my aerospace class. Janae is going to be talking about the dryer, and Caitlin's going to be talking about the washer. All right. Um, so I was a project manager for the drying team. Um, our um, invention was a portable dryer that we can use in the International Space Station. Uh, this is a small port a prototype of one section of the um, a dryer. We place the clothes inside a small canister, a little container. We have another piston squeezing the water out of the, um, the clothes pretty much with hydraulic jack on the bottom. And once the water escapes through the hole, a one-way valve is going to be stored in a container. Um, so take out the piston, take out the clothes, and put them in the heating container. Um, the heating container is the second part of the whole drying process. And the heating container pretty much heats up the clothes for a certain amount of time until the clothes are completely dry and then you may remove the clothes and then pretty much take the water using the cooling system at the International Space Station if needed or cleans it out if needed and pretty much wear your clothes. I'm Caitlin, I'm the project manager for the Hutch team here that we have, um, the other stuff for Clear Lake also. And we're doing the showers that will go up into space and we have our design behind us that we're currently making. We are part of the design team for our project, so it means we came up with all the drawings for the people to look at. And as you see, we have our astronaut. He just walks in, he zips up, and he's ready to take a shower. And that's Teddy Roosevelt. Just... So basically everything that we do for Hunch is documented in our notebooks. We draw the notebooks, so there's several page pages that have the Hunch designs in it. So this is the shower itself, and this is the area where the astronaut would be getting dressed and would store their items. And this is a sketch for for myself, for finding out what materials we need and how much materials that we need. We can't just put a dryer up there, so we're pretty much making like a hair dryer to get the excess water off. This part is the final canister that we've developed. We actually put uh, supports on the outsides of it. We made it smaller. And so that when we actually decide to put the clothes in, the uh, bottle jack will be on the floor and we'll bolt the bottle jack straight through, which will be sitting down here, and you can press the clothes, press the pump into the clothes, squeezing much more water out. Thank you, NASA, for giving us this opportunity.